checked out. Majority of brown skinned humanoid extraterrestrials on planet Earth call themselves black people when that's not their identity. And me, I don't call myself a black person since that's not the color of my skin, right? When I found out the heritage of my alien race of people from a particular planet that my race of people look look like and where they come from, which is from Angel Number Universe 21 of Planet Ice World and Planet Izodio, I, I was able to tap into my potential and utilize my powers to be able to be in sync with my all-seeing, unimines, unihearts, unisouls, eye of street smart, spiritual, common sense, logical, emotional intelligence, and combat power, right? Because this is highly important. For example, Goku, aka Kakarot in Dragon Ball, he thought that he was human, right? Until he learned a heritage of his race of alien people, which is the Saiyans, when he found out that he was a Saiyan, when it came, when it came to clutch time, when Krillin got killed, Goku, aka Kakarot, was able to tap into the powers of a Super Saiyan due to being due to knowing his alien race heritage and be able to tap into that potential and utilize the powers that he was born to do based off his humanoid extraterrestrial DNA powers, right? So what, that's what I'm saying, man. It's very important to really know your your alien species because when you don't and you let these draconian demon room alien slave owner narcissists lie to you about your identity because so many Caucasoid humanoid extraterrestrials on planet Earth keep calling themselves white people when that's not the color of their skin. I mean, I've seen a white polar bear. I've seen a black bear, but I never saw white people in humanoid at in, in like humanoid appearance i never saw black people in humanoid appearance never i just saw brown or caucasoid literally like seriously man like imagine 99.9 percent .9 of these so-called brown skinned humanoid extraterrestrials on planet earth that have different face and nose and head shapes from myself that look different from me and facial features that kept calling themselves black people and they started to realize that they are brown skinned humanoid extraterrestrials regardless of what alien race planet that they came from imagine how more powerful they will be when they find out their true identity when you find out your true identity you're gonna be able to do things to utilize your powers come on man this is all facts for the mind heart and soul my mind, heart, and soul, I sees it. My mind, heart, and soul, I sees it, man. Come on, man. Like, come on, bro. That's like Superman, a.k.a. Clark Kent. When he found out that he was a Kryptonian, he was able to utilize his powers and do things going beyond the potential that he was born to do. When he found out his race of people's heritage and powers and what they could do. When you find out the heritage of what your alien race of people can do, you are going to go beyond your potential and it's going to help you in combat to protect the multiverse. Because if I got to protect the multiverse and I didn't even know my alien race of people and I kept calling myself a black person, how am I going to utilize it in combat and, and tap into that inner strength? Because I, I don't even know who I am because I let a fucking draconian slave owner lie to me about my identity to call myself a black person when that's not the color of my skin. Look at Black History Month, right? Black History Month is a fucking fake ass scam because you know the word black means pale and the color black crayon or these black polar bears or these white polar bears that 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 that, 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 that got their names. Those colors was named something else before the slave owners changed it. Yes, the black crayon and the white crayon used to be called something else before before the slave owners changed the shit. Right? Man, bro, if you know your identity, because look, every time, man, every fucking time on planet Earth, it really makes me fucking sick and, and, and so tiresome. I'm tired of seeing individuals that have my skin complexion keep calling themselves a skin color that's not of their identity. That really pisses me off and it really 
sickens me to that they don't even know their alien race of people's powers. They don't even know who they are, but I can know who I am. I come from angel number universe 21. My life path number is 21. I come from angel number universe 21. Like people, my race of people that have my facial features and my, my whole physical alien abilities. I come from, and I come from angel number universe 21 from planet Oxodio, planet ice world of the city of Emerald Cavern. Like when you know what universe that you come from, when you know which angel number universe you come from, man, come on, man. And you know your alien race people's heritage, man. You gonna be Scott. You gonna be. You gonna be like. You gonna be multiverse rocketing beyond your potential, bro. You know you won't like a lot of humanoid extraterrestrials. Ready right, as a a Caucasoid skin or they of a brown skin complexion. Once they stop calling themselves white and black people, that's when they're gonna start tapping into their potential and actually gonna utilize their extraterrestrial powers that they was born to do within their DNA. These draconian slave owners or these men in black aliens and shit, they fucking corrupted a lot of humanoid extraterrestrials on planet Earth. There's a lot of Architans, Palladians walking around on planet Earth that keep calling themselves white people when that's not their identity. You feel me? This is all facts, man. If you want to like people that seen Dragon Ball and it's fucking popular. When, if you if you can see that Goku learned his identity, that's the reason why he kept getting stronger. He kept getting stronger from Super Saiyan 1, Super Saiyan 2, Super Saiyan 3, and beyond that. Because why? He knew who he was. He knew what his alien race of people was. When you know your alien race of people's heritage, you gonna actually tap into your powers. You can't just take heed and listen to what a fucking slave owner tell you on some false heritage that never existed with your with your clan and the word clan means alien race of people like the uchihas the the, the hugas and naruto you know the hugas and the uchihas and naruto they know they knew who they was they knew who their race of people was they knew what their alien race was that's why they was able to tap into their powers where the, the hyuga had the byakugan the uchiha alien race had the sharingan all facts